Everything we do in Krishna consciousness is not about the external perfection. It's about the internal perfection. It's about doing it with devotion, with love, with sincerity. It's about doing it with, doing it with effort. And we all know this. Patra pushpam palam toyam. Krishna says, offer me a leaf, fruit, flower, water. Offer it with love. So the love is the important thing. We are offering Krishna the Maha Mantra. Every day we're offering Krishna the Maha Mantra. But really what we're supposed to be offering is not just the sound. We're supposed to be offering our love through the Maha Mantra. We're supposed to be offering our prayers through the Maha Mantra. It should be obvious, but somehow it is not so obvious. Somehow when we come to chanting, we tend to impersonalize it, make it into a process uh, we, we're distracted, we're thinking about everything other than Krishna while we're chanting. These are real problems that we have to deal with. And even though we've learned how to chant properly, these problems creep up and often become habits. And therefore, we need Japa retreats regularly to correct, put us back on track. And that's why we're going to be doing, they're coming up in April, we're going to be doing a Japa retreat again after about two years. Uh, two years ago was our last one. We're going to be doing it again because it's really important to correct, recalibrate, get us back on track. And that's the goal of this Japa retreat.